possible to snap from here. Get this. But live wrestling is going to be a little bit more difficult. So a lot of times I'll force a reaction. I'll use my head pressure. I'll use that head pressure again. I'll push him back. When he pushes back toward me, all day. Really easy. Okay, so we get it here. So when we get this, now, the second most important thing is this wrist control right here. Doesn't let go until I'm ready to throw him. Because if I let it go early, he takes a single leg, right? So I want to keep this hand up to his chest. If I let this go early, he grabs my leg. Now we're in a different plank. So we've gotten here, inside tie, open the window. Wrist control, half man. I forced him, he forced me back. Snap, get him here. Go to the far hip, this creates his lever. This, if he punch, punch his arm down hard. He breaks, he breaks that every time, right? But if I go here, punch the arm down hard. Leverage doesn't allow that, right? Just it's a bar. I've created a bar with this arm. So this is why this, this hip is important. So when you get here, really shoot for that far hip. If you feel like you're starting to lose it, you grab onto his belt. He ain't going nowhere, <laughs> that's it, right? So. We get here, now we're in position. I'm gonna do the takedown. When I do the takedown, I'm gonna step my right foot that's back here into my left foot like this, like pigeon toed. I'm gonna to turn and look where I'm gonna go. At the last second before I throw, this wrist is gonna let go and chin strap him. So I'm here, I start to look, I switch to my chin strap, I spiral him down here. Once I get here, I cup, oh, let's spin this way. There we go, thank you. I cup his chin, I keep that chin chin, I cup his shoulder. And I don't twist, it's not a twisting, moving neck break. I'm gonna bring my elbow to my ribs. That's it, quick neck crank, super easy, right? Doesn't take a whole lot. So all I'm doing is this, closing my wings. That's it, nice and easy. So I'm here, I'm not trying to do some big kung fu, rah, rip your head off. I get here, I cup his shoulder, I put my weight on him. I have a good wide base, we'll discuss that in a minute. And I bring his el my elbow to my ribs, and there's your neck crank, super easy. If you have neck injuries, let go of that, that neck before you hit the ground, please, so you don't wreck your partner's neck. Oh, yes. All right, so 